On the show today, a special guest indeed, a person who's actually going to make it hugely big, bigger than she has in golf. I'm sure that's her ambition. Sharmila mm. Nicolette, thanks for joining us. Yeah. Thank you. Talk to us about how you got into golf and I know you're in just class 12. Yeah. You've got boards ahead of you and yeah. then there's that passion for golf. I started golf at the age of 11 and um, I first joined the AJGA camp and my family's in a golf, like my dad, my dad, from, my, my grandmother from my dad's side, my cousins. So I started for fun in the beginning and then later I realized that I started developing this talent for golf and uh, I took it seriously and it got me so far and hopefully I'll make it to the top and to the LPGA tour, which is my main goal. But the fact that you're, you're still to turn pro, right? Yeah. I guess it has a lot to do with age. Yeah, but I'm in a crossroad right now whether to, to play college golf or turn professional. But I'm thinking of turning professional in April or August or something and um, take it on from there. Having, having sort of joined uh, the game pretty earlier on, led by a whole family being, yeah. you know, in, of, of players, mm -hmm. does, does that sort of mount the pressure on you a bit that you want to get into the big league? Yeah, there's a lot of pressure, like peer pressure also. and. Um, What's the peer pressure like? Like, you know, all of distractions like friends and um, other teenage temptations, distractions one has to overcome to reach the top. And I've given up a lot of other sports because I used to be very sportive and I, I was in a swimming, athletics, basketball, riding, tennis. So I had to give up all those so that I can be more dedicated and committed to this game. Why did you choose golf? It was just like a, by chance, an accident, but you said um, that you were sporty otherwise, yeah. so then? I love golf, it's very challenging, you, you get to play against yourself and against the course and um, and also I'm a very competitive person by nature and um, I like playing under pressure and I love nature, the surrounding, the fresh air, the greenery and that's why I love playing golf and then I've developed this passion for it and I hope to take it seriously. Now we're going to talk to you a lot about really your golf. Right. What is it about your golf that makes you different from potential golfers? Um, I'm a very long hitter and I'm very aggressive to this game. I'm not really defensive and um, That's I like an advantage, I yeah. Guess. And I like shooting under par. Like I have this thing of shooting under par, so it's good. But I have to make it consistent and accurate for me to reach another level. And I don't know, my mental thing is very strong, so that helps me. I love playing under pressure, which is also a good thing for a person. When one talks about, you know, the idea of taking golf to the next level, yeah. obviously it's not going to happen so easily if you stick, stick to one course and yeah. to that matter, just stay in India. Are you planning now to step out and, you know, take golf ahead? You need to go abroad and play in the courses there because the courses are a whole lot different compared to India, in Indian courses. And coaching abroad is also different. I worked with Ledbetter last year, personally with him, and he's really good. He, he improved my game a lot. And I'm planning to go this year too in June before I turn pro. So that will help me go to the next level mentally and physically.